Okay, welcome back folks. Just would like to tell y'all we're about to start our next mission. Well, we should, it was actually a continuation of the other mission we just had. Which is going to be past and perfect. Trapped in the past, you must restore the timeline before all is known and lost and forever. I've spoken with Starfleet Intelligence. Listen carefully. You were to use the Guardian portal to follow Bavat wherever or whenever he went. Find him, and stop him from altering the past. Stop the Klingons, save Moral Paris, and restore the timeline. Okay, let's see what we get. Hmm. Don't need type 1 phaser. That is a good engine. That's a decent shield. Let me see which one would I get. I'll get the engine. Let's see. Why the hell? Okay. Let's use the portable. If I get disconnected, folks, I will st pick up where I left off at. For some reason, I don't know if it's everyone else, but ever since the new updates, that's all I've been getting. Server not responding ever since Agents of Yesterday came out. I mean, it looks like the Guardian forever took us back to our ship, sir, and I don't believe it. Our chronometer meters show that we have been transported to the year of 2270. Let's get our bearings. Sir, it's strange. It appears that the history of files on our computers have been altered according to computers. This is the point in time when the USS Enterprise and all the void was lost. This defeat sparked a series of events that led to the downfall of the United Federation of France. That's all wrong, coming. It looks like provide is changing history already. I'm detecting a Klingon Raptor from our time command. It looks like the IKS Wolverine and I'm reading Lieutenant Paris comm signal is on board. The Wolverine is attacking the Enterprise. We have to stop it through Captain whatever from our time cannot allow the change of the past. Sir, the Enterprise is yelling us, patching us through now. Unknown ship, this is the USS Enterprise. Please respond. Command is transmitting text only messages. Let them know we're friendly to help. Less interaction from North is the less chance that we have altering the timeline ourselves. Okay.
So the Enterprise is handling this gun, patching it through now. Unknown vessel, this is Commander Spock of the USS Enterprise. Thank you for your assistance. Commander Mr. Spock is asking to identify ourselves so our crew can not respond. All contact we have with anyone at this time would be considered violating the Temporal Prime Directive. We should concentrate on Final Lieutenant Patterson correcting the damage that the Klingons have done in the timeline. The Wolverine warped the nearby system. I can get a lock on a warp so I can sure we looked to be able to follow it. Captain have locked on the Wolverine and Lieutenant Paris signal. The Wolverine has some new friends, sir. We should be prepared defending ourselves. Shields are down, Commander. We recommend take the opportunity to transport away team. ourselves.
Let's see what type of puzzle it's going to be. Well, I have to open up the crate. Several times for it, but find difficult to work with. They suggested pursuing more transport allies elsewhere. Also, high priority directive disabled the enterprise at any cost. We are too aware of how important that ship is to success of the Federation. Daniels will want to hear about this. Copy that and wipe the memory. Core. Is there anything else through here? Your enemy. Ask me what you will. What do you want to know about her? I know you are not of this time. You are from the future. A temporal agent. Your presence here was forecast. Forecast by whom? Many years ago, the Nakul came to us from the future. They wanted us to fight in their temporal war, but not as equals. Klingons are no one's pawns. The Empire refused their generous offer. However, the Nakul told us many things about the future in their attempt to gain our allegiance. We listened, and since then a group of Klingons has used that knowledge to guide the Empire. Mevyak, I am not your enemy, as she is the Kuva Mach. We walk in her footsteps before she has made them. Her destiny is to be the one who cures the Klingon people. She will wash away the stain of the Augment virus that has smoothed our brows and put fear into our hearts. She's been here two months already? Yes, and we are beginning to see results. The Kuva Mach has a unique genetic sequence that has allowed my physicians to completely transform us back to the mighty warriors we once were. No more will we be ridgeless and honorless. We will be Klingon! We will follow in the Kuva Mach's footsteps and walk in the path of honor and glory! Mevyap, I am not your enemy. Some call her a savior. Many among my crew see her as a traitor. It is strange to see a mythological being wearing the uniform of your enemy. I don't know what I believe of the old ways. The prophecies say she will be a voyager, and that the Klingons will know her before she knows the world. What I have seen in these past days makes me believe this is true. Mevyap, I am not your enemy. Ask me what you will. Most of them are crazed by their contact with the augmentation process. Their leader tells me they were experimented on by a man named Amar Singh. They will do anything, kill anyone in their quest to be whole again. Okay. They arrived here a month ago. They brought the Kuva Mach with them, and they asked me to keep her safe. They left for a time and then returned two days ago with this wonder of a starship. 
They told me that it was the first of a mighty fleet that would rule the galaxy. Their leader. It is my greatest shame to see him. I have come face to face with my future self, and I see that I will walk a path of great dishonor. Mevyap, I am not your enemy. Ask me what you will. Ambassador Bavat is the man I will become. Time travel is such a tricky thing. Now I understand why Klingon intelligence hates predestination paradoxes so. Sounds like Ambassador Bavat will not surrender the Kuva Mach without a fight. It appears that the years have made him, made me, quick to anger and quick to judge. I wonder what will happen to make me such a bitter, manipulative man. Mevyak, I am not your enemy. Ask me what you will. When one travels back in time, one may cause or undo the reason for the journey. Anything we do now may alter the reality that you know. Then again, the reality we know could not exist unless we were here at this time and place. I would advise you not to volunteer for many more time travel missions. They tend to complicate your life. Mevyap, I am not your enemy. You are the defenders of the Kuva Mark. You will find Ambassador Bavat at her side. He will not surrender her without a fight. Give him a good death. That is all any Klingon desires. Allow Bavai to beam out. Mevyap! I didn't appreciate being held captive, but if I can help the Klingons, I will gladly do so. Think of it this way. If we can find peace here, there's hope for the future. Did they harm you? No, but the Klingons of this time have the genetic samples they need from me, and I am more than ready to get back to our time. Thank you. I won't forget what you did today. Provide an crew is being transported off the moment, Captain. You can't do the ship here. The technology is too far advanced for the time. I suggest we return to our ship and destroy Wolverine. That's why we preserve the timeline. It's empty now, sir. The weapons are locked on your command. We 
we've done it. What we can to restore the timeline. I recommend return to the gateway system. Transfer back to where we belong. What to the gateway system? I hate these servers not responding. Sir, the Garni has opened a portal for a clean ship back away. Continue. Teams are handling us. Captain putting it on screen. Incoming message. The Kuva Mach and that lovely ship of yours are staying here. We'll have a grand time dissecting both of them. Surrender now, and we'll give you a quick death. Sir, the Enterprise is handling us again. Commander Spock says they can assist as he has the deduct that we came through a portable opened by the Gateway Forever and he wishes to speak to you. I am not unfamiliar with time travel, Captain. We will endeavor to engage the Klingons until you can escape. Live long and prosper. Always messes up right when I'm in a bit doing something. These servers not responding is getting to be a real pain in the behind.
Well, while this is acting up, just would like to inform y'all, please check my videos every day. Okay. Speak to the Guardian. Time has resumed its shape. All is as it was before. Farewell. Congratulations on a job well done. Lieutenant Paris will return to duty, and you have ended the threat to the Federation. But we do have some questions. Time travel is not a routine mission, you know. Don't be surprised if you get a visit from the Department of Temporal Investigations. Predestination paradoxes can be troubling for them. That's the end of this mission. Let's go ahead and depart. But, uh, Mazes, Lord and others like to tell y'all, hope y'all are enjoying my videos despite the server not responding issues that as y'all can tell in my videos I do apologize for that I don't think I need to tell you how important the mission you just completed was for all of us the very fabric of our universe was at stake and you acted with professionalism and aplomb thanks to you and your crew ambassador Bavat's plan was foiled temporal investigations does want to talk to you about how the description of your ship is now showing up in the USS Enterprise's mission logs. But I told them you didn't have time to report for debriefing. Mm-hmm. You get that engine, it's a good engine. Congratulations, Captain. Okay. We can hear by Ammo Queen. Promotion to Captain. Congratulations. Cap You've proven yourself to be invaluable to Starfleet and earn the respect of your fellow officers. Return to Earth Space Dock. I would like to formally recognize your contributions to the Federation. Hmm. Okay. Well, next mission, we're going to go ahead and get our promotion. Next ship. We've detected an anomaly in the... Next ship. And... Update our crew, but I think that's what I'm going to end up doing next one. Now, I'm not sure if I will get a temporal ship or use probably Voyager ship, I'm not sure yet, but I will decide that when I make that next video. So until next time, everyone, live long and prosper.